Hey, we're getting a first-hand look at what Columbia police officers and the community outreach unit will be doing on the job. Thanks for joining us. I'm Joey Parker. And I'm Marissa Hollowed. We told you last night the four remaining positions on the unit have been filled. Today, ABC 17's Jillian Furtig rode along with the two officers who have been working in the unit since April. She's joining us now live from the police station with a look inside the community outreach unit. Jillian. Well, today I spent two hours with those officers going to three main areas where the entire unit is going to be assigned uh, when they transition there in February. And we've been telling you about the unit's goals as well as the mission, and today we got to see them in action. What we generally do is we try to walk through here a few times a day and just talk to people. The first stop for community outreach officers Wednesday afternoon, Douglas Park. Officers Justin Anthony and Tony Parker say this is how they have gotten to know people in the community and build relationships. Since we began doing this, it took a while to start to get to know the people, but eventually, yeah, they'll come up to you and talk to you, and you guys will have good conversation about what's going on in the world or around Columbia itself. Uh, a lot of times, they'll even start getting asking advice if they need help with something, and then that's where it's made nice to make the connections with the community. That way, we can direct them to a service that they needed. Anthony says they are still police officers, but working in the unit allows them to help people in other ways by directing them to services like programs for substance abuse or unemployment. The second stop was Bodie Drive, an area that has seen heavy crime over the last couple years. We need to follow up with this guy. We've knocked on every door in this area and then a lot of the other areas and just introducing ourselves. That way people start to get to know us when they see us down the, walking down the street. They don't just automatically think something bad happened. They're just, you know, we're here and we're their local cops that, to help them out if they need anything. Hey! Anthony says he's already seen a difference just in the way people in the area approach him and Parker. The, the unit, I personally believe, is already paying dividends with building the, the relations. And our third stop, McKee Street, another area that has had crime issues in the past. Anthony says being in the unit allows him time to actually get to know people in the neighborhoods he works. A luxury, he says, that's not quite as easy when working in patrol. The people have to trust us enough that when they call with a problem that we're going to be able to handle the problem one way or the other. We're told the community outreach unit will still respond to service calls in the areas they're assigned. And the entire unit will be going through training over the next couple of months. Reporting live in Columbia, Jillian Furtick, ABC 17 News. Thanks, Jillian. The four officers recently selected for the positions will transition to the new roles in February.